Hey guys, it's Amber here. Thank you so much for joining me today on my channel, Plan Aloud. And today is a fun little haul from the new spring release by Happy Planner. And let me just show you what I got. So I got these. These are actually from the, you know, new spring collection. And then I got all these older planners. So we're gonna do this first. So although I love my planner that I've been using, a planner that I've built up from, you know, scratch with extension packs and everything, I have been wanting to try out a couple of different layouts. And also these planners ended up being like really, really cheap. So even if I don't end up using the guts, which I'm really hoping that I'm like not wasteful and I do, but like, the covers, one of these planners ended up being $7 and the other two were 8 So I think that's still a pretty good deal for covers. I think this is so cute for springtime. So let's go through the planners. You guys probably already seen these. These are old planners, like I said. And I honestly got this one specifically for the cake, for the cover, because I just think it's so cute. It is a vertical layout. It is January through December 2023 vertical layout, which is the layout I normally use. So I, when I got my order, I opened it up and I took everything out that made tons of noises except for this. <laughs> so that we didn't have to like deal with that. And then it shows you the vertical layout at the beginning. Let's see, does this one say what the planner is called? No, but this is by Paula and Waffle, or Paula and Waffle by Paula. But look at the inside, it's really darling. So this is the beginning of the planner. It gives you an overview of 2023 and 2024, and just like at a glance. And then there are these sheets. I don't know what these are, at a glance sheets. I don't know what they're called. I haven't used a, like a newer happy planner in so long so I don't even know and I don't even know what I would use those for so I'm assuming this would be your currently page and here is January the monthly and the weekly so this planner although it is incredibly darling on the inside it's way too much color for my liking. I want my planners to come incredibly plain. That's too much. Yeah, there. I would have to cover up too much, like especially like up here. Too, too much to cover. So I might just like play around in this planner, figure out new styles that I can like share with you guys because I want to expand the kinds of things that I am showing on my channel. And then, like, these can always be reused. It's so cute. This is really cute. I love this. So we're just going to look at the dashboards now. Or at the... Yeah, I think that's what they're called. And look at that one, April. It's so cute. This little rainbow. Alright, and then this is the same as the cover. But instead of gold, it has this teal. I actually prefer the teal. It's really cute. But that's because it's my favorite color. And then June. That's really cute. Oh, look at July. It's my birthday month. And the thing is, like, I can all you can always like take these out and like tape it together. And I could like use this dashboard for, you know, the current year but I probably won't. Maybe if I set up a planner for next year. August, this is clearly going back to school. And then September, Nourish. Ooh, this is pretty. Dream, it's another one of my favorite colors, green. Then November is for making, sewing, creating. And then December is celebrate. This is really cute. So yeah, I like this planner. I got it specifically for the cover. I'm gonna figure out something to do with 
the inside. Like I have lots of guts. I have three planners with tons of guts. And I can always relabel them and um, use them next year. Though so I probably won't. I'm just gonna cut this out now. So this planner is an 18 month planner. Started in July, 2022. So we already know there's about eight months in here that I can't even use. And this is a horizontal planner. And I bought this one honestly specifically for the the cover as well. It's so cute and it's gonna go really good with the new discs that I got, which are those like lime green discs. So like I said, this is a horizontal. And I actually do have a very specific use for this planner. I am going to use it to track all my exercise, all my eating, everything. Any ailments that I'm having, it's basically going to be like a complete health planner, but I'm going to mix it in with my regular planner. So it will be like my regular catch-all at the beginning of my planner, and then these this will go behind it specifically for all my health needs so we have a year overview for 2022 2023 and then I'm, I'm assuming these are at a glance kind of things look at the covers or the dashboard it's so cute and then the monthly and then the horizontal pages and I like that it's really neutral but it just has that gray line that isn't you know too harsh like once they like get rid of that they'll be a pretty perfect planner because it is pretty neutral okay so now we just need to look at the these my life is sweet and this is from last year oh how lovely Bring your own sunshine. Spread some happy today. It's really cute. Ooh, I just like that striped one. It's really cute. Ooh, I really love this. So this is for this year, January. And then February, hello happy. So, so good. That's March, which we're in right now. And this is April. So this is where I'm gonna start. I'm actually gonna start um, after my vacation because of course on your vacation you get a little crazy um, so on the sixth when I'm back from my vacation I am going to do a new planner setup which I will take you guys along where I in like can put these into my new planner look at this this is just the same as the cover really cute every day is a fresh start Ain't that the truth? Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I just love the, the colors. It's really cute. Just some pears and some strawberries. Everything is just peachy. Make room for good things. What is this? Papaya, pineapples, watermelons. And then hip hip hooray for November and if you were a fruit you'd be a fine apple <laughs> and that's for December so this is really great so not only do I have extra sheets if I want to you know redate which I don't have a problem with redating so this might actually just be my planner my health planner for the next 18 months it was just gonna start in April and also for these covers and then I like to keep these discs because I don't typically use a lot of plastic discs except for all my old planners that I keep stored away. So here is another 18 month planner and I have been wanting to try a dashboard planner for the longest time and I just didn't want to buy a brand new one that was like 30 bucks so that's why I waited until it was on sale and I also wanted to get one that was like actually cute and I love this cover so this is 18th month planner July 2022 to December 2023 and this is just gonna be a planner that I pretty much just play with and see if I actually like the dashboard layout um, I see so many planner babes using the dashboard layout and loving it and although I use a vertical the vertical isn't the perfect planner for me right now 
maybe I need something else. So that's why I got the horizontal. Oh, this got some something on it. That's why I got the horizontal for my health. And then that's why I got the dashboard so I can just honestly just plan. So here's the overview and whatever those are called. And then this starts in July. And if you haven't seen the dashboard before, you get your monthly view like normal. And you can always change your categories. You don't ever have to keep them the same. And this is like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I mean, I would probably use that for my meal plans. I think that was perfect. And then, you know, all your things that you got going on for the week. And then maybe this says get it done. So for maybe your most important tasks that you need to get done, errands, calls, emails, focus on and note it. Like I said, you can always change them up. You don't have to keep them the same or anything like that. So it is pretty neutral, which I like. And I feel like the gray wouldn't like be like so like annoying. So this is just what it looks like. And now we'll just look at these dividers. I keep calling them dashboards, but they're dividers. <laughs> okay, plant dreams, pull weeds, and grow a happy life. That's for August. Beauty is all around. It's really cute. Bloom and grow, be strong, and know you're beautifully you. October. When in doubt, add flowers straight up. These are so pretty. And I can always use these dashboards or <laughs> these for um something else i actually like to put them in the backgrounds of my photos sometimes it works out really good this is this is beautiful flowers are always a good idea straight up a flower does not think of competing with the flower next to it it just blooms that's nice so now we're in 2023 so you can see I have six months to like really play with. Actually eight. Technically nine. So that's January. February. March. Grow through what you go through. Believe in the good. This is pretty. Oh my gosh. I love this. And then one happy life. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. June. July, the grass is green where you water it straight up. August, be like a flower and reach for the sun. September, October, this color scheme is just gorgeous. Never stop dreaming. I like these darker florals. And then December. So, I have a lot to play around with. This is going to be very exciting for me. And now we're gonna go into all the new stuff from the new collection. I didn't see tons of stuff in this collection that I like. These were like the bare minimum items that I like. There is one thing that I did like that I didn't get, and that is a gray snap and cover. It's very similar to the one I already have, which is this one right here. So it looks pretty much like this, but this part right here is like a minty green, which is like my favorite color, so, or one of my favorite colors. So I really want it, but, I'm like, I might wait till it goes on sale or something. It might sell out. But I did grab the the metal disc, the new metal disc. And I planned on when I do my cover switch over. I think I might do this cover with these discs. Or this cover with these discs. So I got both sets of metal discs and these are like, I don't know what they're calling these discs, but they look mint green to me. So let's pop them open. And they are packaged a little bit different than the old discs. They are just, they just put them in. They used to come in like a plastic thing, but they just go in like that. And they're really pretty. They're like pearl essence like kind of color they're really pretty and I have white discs like this and they're like my favorite 
and then I had to grab the purple ones as well. I love putting my planners on metal disc as opposed to plastic. They kind of just seem to like flip the page better. I don't know. I could be biased, but here are the purple discs. They are gorgeous. And if you like like the Tinkerbell stuff, you like get these and put it on the new like Tinkerbell planners or notebooks. So cute. But yeah, those ones are pearl chill, pearlish. They're so pretty and they like you can like see they're like rainbow changing in it. So I got those. Pretty much like a hoe for metal discs. And then these are some envelopes, and these are from the line Made to Bloom. I didn't get anything else from this line except for the envelopes, and that's because I love envelopes in my planners. I put my receipts in here, and if there's any extra paperwork that I need, like these, like I know a lot of people may not use them, but I love them, and they work really nicely. And I do save like my meal plans so I can put all my old meal plans in here because I like to actually go through my old meal plans to create new meal plans. So um, just to see like the different things that we've eaten over time. But yeah, I really love the envelopes. So I'm going to set that to the side. And then I grabbed two new sticker books. I, there were tons of new sticker books, but these were the only two that really caught my eye um i'm surprised that anything from this spring release caught my eye because probably for the past two years the happy planner collections have not been catching my eye which have been a little bit of a bummer so of course everybody knows that they've gone through their rebrand and it's not the happy planner anymore it's happy planner and this is called softly modern it has 746 pieces I got this because it is just, the color palette is just so beautiful and so like calming and I haven't been like saying too much but that's been going on in my life but my life has been hectic and stressful and um, my body feels like it's kind of breaking down on me, it's just like a lot of personal stuff so this really like spoke to me, it's really pretty these colors bloom just be kind today is the day live simply I'm not gonna read all the boxes um, but I will read some and um, of course these were on paper these are on clear these are really pretty bold beautiful and brave joy if you guys have been around for a while this book reminds me of oh old sticker book that I still use and love. If I remember it, I will tell you. These flowers really remind me of it. So these are on clear with white back or like clear backing. And these are paper with like a pink. So when you pull it up, it's gonna have like a pink outline as opposed to white. And these just are like important appointment, priority, you got this, remember, noted, scheduled errands on paper, on clear. And these say reflect, hello today, rest day, busy day, breathe, love this, not today, take a nap. I need a million of those. <laughs> and then we have floral boxes. I hope they have some of these boxes, but not with florals in it because the colors are so pretty. It's okay to slow down, which is nice. Seasons change and so do we, so true. And that is my word of the year, change. And that's what I'm trying to do, change it up. These just all say hello today in a different way. Keep believing in you. Kind words cost nothing, straight up. These are really cute. I'm starting to really like the arch boxes and I think that's because of girl power. And that's one of my favorite books is Girl Power. This is so pretty. I love this washi. Okay, important to remember, take note and jot it down. 
take a break, go relax today, grateful for, love this. I think that's the same quote at the bottom. No, but that is the same kind of washi. I think they're just in different colors. They have a whole box for cancel this. That's kind of weird. Should have just been that, but whatever. Schedule this. These are really pretty. These are dwell in possibility, peace and gratitude, strive for balance, let your dreams bloom, blossom. And then we have long boxes. I love all these functional boxes or functional pieces in the middle. This reminds me of fall for some reason and the fact that it came out in spring is just interesting. It's really pretty though. Like it's really soft and dainty. It, it brings like a calm. Today I'm feeling. They all say that. And that is bronze. And then today I'm feeling with no bronze. I like that the the bronze is complimenting it. Some layering boxes, some more functional stuff, some pretty quotes with like speckles of bronze. Be kind, focus, hello today, appointment for forever busy, straight up. <laughs> um, hope today, note, noted, dream big errands. And those are all bronze. And here are more in bronze, no bronze, but they say something different. Happiness, choose joy, you got this. Shine bright, laugh often, be brave, bold and bright, beauty, kindness. Goals for this week. It's a cool shape. And then some more, but in soft yellow. And some more in a pretty blue. These are cute. These are paper, but they're gold. Why? It should have been bronze. And more in just the color scheme of the book. And these pretty much say a lot of the things that they've been saying in the rest of the book. And they are like clear, they're clear stickers. Circles though. Pretty. And then more in this like peachy color. And they basically say the same thing. Hello today, relax, happy. You got this, remember, take a nap, plan on it, not today. Be kind, just be you, read, love your life. Hello today, relax. Oh, nope, that's repeating. So there's 12. 12 little sayings. And then we have quote strips, which is really nice. We have some that are of importance, like appointment, remember, priority, and then these are just quotes. Short quotes, long quotes. Ooh, skinny washi. This is like my favorite, this skinny washi. Love it. That's my jam. And that is that book, and that is called Softly Modern. And then, if you've been here, I love Spoonful of Faith, the original one. I love that book. I use it pretty frequently. So, of course, I had to get this one. And this is called Beautiful and Brave. And let's go. Oh, so pretty. These colors. I would choose Faith over Fear. And this is a faith book, but to me, it doesn't seem like... A truly religious kind of faith book it to me it reminds me more of a spiritual book than faith like based in any certain denomination and spiritual to me anybody can be spiritual I'm more spiritual than religious my own personal beliefs but yeah this is this is pretty you are wanted and loved that's so cute let's read this one here's to a strong kind gentle fears Hopeful, change-making woman. That's a big one. Long quote. These are really cute today. 
oh, these are like the same from the other book, but they're really, really cute. Meditate on things. Yes. I meditate almost nightly. I haven't been lately, but I do meditate. These are really cute. These are on clear. Let me see. Is it separated? No, it's all hooked together. So you just have to write on that in like Sharpie. Ooh, look at this. Check it off. And the accent color in this book, what I'm seeing so far is gold. Don't forget, she is a dreamer. Meditate on things, true. And then some pretty, let me see, is this? I'm a, yeah, this is classic. They do say on the front, like if it's a classic book or not. So that's what I was looking for. Do you guys hear the rain? <laughs> Look at these boxes, they are beautiful. I love these circles. And these are on paper. How I'm feeling today. Those are really, really good. And um, like my journal. Today I'm grateful for, meditate. Oh, I love these meditate. That's going to be people. Look at this. These boxes are just gorgeous. I will give myself grace. Good things grow here. Straight up. It's so nice. This book is beautiful. This is probably my favorite, favorite sticker book I've seen in a long time. I am fearfully and willfully made. It's so pretty. I love the colors. I am strong, brave, capable. I am destined for great things. I am strong, brave, capable, and... Oh, same thing. I don't even have to read it. It's the exact same quote. I love these boxes. Speak good things to yourself. Straight up. We say so many nasty things to ourselves. And just bring ourselves down. This is so pretty. some different shapes it's really pretty I'm obsessed I love these functionals I love me a functional because I love creating a gratitude list and a to-do list usually I don't find them already made that I like this yellow that's a good yellow these are all celebrate meditate breathe relax Ooh. Oh, yes. I love these hearts. I love hearts. Your words matter. Speak life. Straight up. These are so cute. These are all on clear paper, as the other page was as well. These are so pretty. Love changes everything. Keep showing up. Speak good things to yourself. Yes. This looks like somebody like hand wrote it, you know? It's so cute. Oh my, this. Yes, so cute. I am grateful. I am grateful. Grateful and thankful. These colors are just so pretty and just so like soothing. And there's some more of those boxes. If I use this, I'd probably cut it because that's a big spot at the beginning. Oh, that, there's that oblong shape again. It's really cute. These things all are just repeating quotes from earlier in the book. Paper, right? These are on clear. Um, rejoice over every victory. Straight up. Don't you dare give up. Straight up. This book is, is so nice. Let me see. Love changes everything. Open hands, open hearts. Focus on the good things. Here's to strong, kind, gentle, fierce, hopeful. Oh, that's another quote that is repeated. These are on clear as well. But that is pretty. Like when you pull it up, it's going to be really pretty on a page, you know? It's going to be very soft, you know? Gentle. 
her hair is so cute. That's what my hair looks like when I don't tame it. So these are the same as those other stickers in the exact same. They're just not colorful. They're just gold. Celebrate, meditate, breathe, relax. I love this. I like these washies. These are all to-dos. Ooh, they're smaller oblongs. Oh my gosh. And they're all clear. This one is so, so pretty. Ooh. I will run my race at my pace. I like that. Focus on the good things. These are really beautiful. This is so cute. And these are a lot of the quotes that they've repeated in the book before. You get some sprinkles. I call the like little splotchy sprinkles. Some cute little other accessories. Or other deco, I mean. These are on clear as well. The other ones have like a dot, um, a grid. But these ones are not. But you would still have to write on washi on top of those. And there is that book. Oh my gosh, this is my favorite. I am going to do a plan with me with this book probably incredibly soon. So I have the Spoonful of Faith, Beautiful and Brave sticker book. This one is softly modern. I got the three envelopes from the Made to Bloom collection. The two sets of uh, metal disc. I don't know if they had any other disc or any, they had other discs, they didn't have any other metal disc. I got both. Like I said, I'm kind of a hope for those. This is my horizontal planner. This is my 12 month vertical. And this is my dashboard. And these did not come from the spring collection. These are all current planners to be used up by this year if you guys like this you guys should definitely give me a thumbs up like subscribe comment click the notification so you'll be notified when i post content thank you so much for joining me today i hope you've seen something you like and if you did it then go check out that spring collection from happy planner thank you again for watching and remember to have a beautiful one and try something new Bye.